My name is Anointing Chibuwanem. Today we are going to be discussing about the three elements of self-image. You see, self-image in itself is how we see ourselves both internally and externally. Our self-image is built on how we perceive reality. It continues and runs through our lifetime. It also changes over time, which shows that we also have influence over it. You wonder why you get angry or upset when someone ridicules your outfit, say something about what you have said or what you have done. It is because we are all overprotective of our self-image. You would not allow anybody to trample on it. Your self-image is made up of three different parts which runs closely to each other. Number one is the way you see yourself. The way you see yourself the way you what you think about yourself is all determined by how you walk how you talk and relate with people number two is the way you think people see you yes the way you think and interpret how others perceives you is a very big part of your self-image for example you feel less important if you think others don't respect and admire you of course it will create negative feelings for you now the third part is how people actually sees you and what you really mean to people as in how people define you for example if you think that you're a good story writer or maybe you think you're a good author and you just put a story out and maybe someone comes to you and tell you oh you your story sucks your story is very, very not really good. You need to, you know, improve. Of course, you feel, you feel like discouraged. You feel you have a um, low self-esteem because what you actually think about yourself is not what others think about you. So it will make you discouraged, make you feel less esteemed. And in the other hand, assuming you think you're a very good author and you put a story out and people actually see you and tell you, wow, what's a good story you wrote there. The story actually is nice, very, very nice. And you know that this will make you happy. It will make you feel positive in every way. It will make you feel like, yes, yes, this is actually what I am, you know. It will make you feel elated and make you feel important. It increases your your self-esteem believe me everybody on earth will be happy if all three parts of their self-image has a balance so if all three parts has a balance the person will be more happy have high self-esteem have high self-confidence the person will be more organized and more in control of his life you see in life when you seek out friendship and relationship with other people you have to make sure that you shock all these parts of your self-image to make them feel more happier, more in control, more happy. Just find a way to make them comfortable around you. Find a way to make people more happy because when you keep on making them feel more important, more essen essential, they are going to be even more happier. So today, when you go out to seek friendship and relationship with other people, you have to find a way to create balance in all these three core self-image of people. I'll leave you with this. This is my caller from you. Peace. Hey guys, you want to get more videos about how to increase your relationship with people and motivation and other cool video concerning about your daily relationship with people please if you want to get it don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell and we'll keep you updated with new videos when we bring it out thank you for watching and god bless you